versus play. <laughs> yeah, get them. Get those hyper marbles. It's like the Mario Party minigame with some crazy music on it. Man, this big dude. You know they're bringing back BattleBots, that TV show? So I heard. <laughs> I wonder what a modern take of that will be like with drones and stuff. Drones and funding, both. How do I get rid of this big one? Do I even need to? Yes, I do. By fooling him? Why don't I just get rid of the guard? Why would I want that up there? I contend that I don't. That it's bad for me that that's there. It's hard enough to manipulate the enemy into the wall without the, the defense being up. They die instantly and I don't. Especially the big one, like, ridiculously hard to get him in. Damn. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, no taste. Thanks for the sub. Hyper marbles. For when super marbles aren't quite enough. There it is. Yeah, I don't I don't know that there actually is any marbles anywhere. We're not really, we're wheels with um jets on the end. We seem like little motorcycles. Not unicycles, but like Close to it, a unicycle motorcycle without a rider. Motorized wheels. There's oil, it makes you spin out. It's gross. Oh, it's good for me though. It messes the AI up a lot. Especially the big guy.
Okay. Get in there. What's this defensive node? Come on. I really don't like the big ones. It just feels so hard to do anything. Joker, thanks for the sub. I cannot even begin to move these enemies. I need my charge. Shit. Well, I have earned some extra lives, so that's good. Oh man, he's got a dash. God. We only get that one try. Ugh. This level's crazy hard. The yellow one is actually dangerous. He's an aggressor. He's as dangerous as another player. Considering how hard this is to control, like really actually is as dangerous as another player. <laughs> I can't win. Back to the start. Oh my god, nothing's working. I missed the oil slick that helped me out. The AI does not make any freaking mistakes. They have three on one going on here. There we go, I got him. He tripped. On, on the corpse of his buddy. Now about the big guy. He's slowly rolling this way. I feel like we have health unless we get really rocketed into the the electricity and then we die instantly. Them too. <laughs> Easier stage. Much worse stage, I think. I don't know what purple's thing is. How am I gonna get rid of them? The green one just killed itself, the tiny one. Almost had him there. I could just finish him off. Ugh. Damn it. <laughs> I guess it's okay to take that death. There we go. I'll just move forward. Oh my god. Yep. 
Yeah, there's only one song. Just like Tetris 99. I mean, I guess that one has three, technically, but, you know. Got rid of green. Yellow is still scary. Oh, my God. How do I get rid of yellow? The worst one. They can't even get over here and they're still giving me so much trouble. Maybe if I just hang out here, they'll screw up. It would appear that that's not the case. No, it, it's so much. There's so many of them. Oh, come on. Get rid of the dangerous one. Somebody said this game is not very long. I wonder how far we had to go. How many rounds are there in the long play? It's too hard to kill them here. It's 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 stupidly hard. The round numbers in the top left. We're only on stage 11. <laughs> I didn't think it would take as long to finish this last guy off as it is. He's just very safe moving. Twenty. Yeah, so we were getting there, but there's still a ways to go. I know this game. What the what gong? Ah. Just like I remember it. How many of these jokes can possibly exist? They've used them all up. They're out. Can't leave. Have a wrench. How do I get that, man? Well, whatever. I do enjoy the way we turn into a scrap of a man as we go through. The 
That's actually pretty neat. For as shitty as this game actually is. Thank you for the, the crash sub as well. So our animations change and everything, along with our body parts missing. The way we control even changes a little bit. Largely, it's not the worst platformer ever because of that kind of stuff. That's pretty neat. That's the best thing that this game does, though, and that's kind of like the end of the praise. The rest of it's just okay, if that. Okay. That car is ridiculously fast. And so are those. Oh my god, don't don't run that fast, please. Oh no. We have a wrench to throw. A limited supply. So I, I hesitate to ever use them, but we do have them. The jump sound is literally a teaspoon sound kind of effect. Right, it's just a spinning thing. Cool. That's not good. Speed limit 155. Oh, you could never go that fast. Oh boy. Oh, that's wild. Of course this game is bound to get ridiculously hard, right? Just a matter of time before it gets off the rails with unfairness. These platforms are so weird. There's a lot of stuff that comes at you at inhuman speeds in this. You're just not gonna evade. We're too slow to dodge that even with the speed that they gave me. Um. I got launched into a plane. God. Why oh, the four planes? What the? F Getting a drink. Hold on a second. What is this for? 
I don't know what the... I guess it's just points. Onto my torso. Oh. Whole lo this whole level is one thing, one big stupid journey. How do you beat this? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> you must have to be extremely good at not taking hits to uh to make it through this kind of gauntlet. It just it just keeps on rolling. And I'm already half dead. So I'm 2 HP down out of, what, 7? That seems like a decent amount of HP, but they don't heal you very much. And there's so much that you can't really dodge. That's how you dodge that. You, you have to roll, which I discovered is a thing recently. Oh my god. Full health, and I want to say I'm like 10% of the way through the stage. <laughs> now, probably a little bit more than that, but I'm maintaining full form. He's got to screw his parts back on. That all checks out. This has the same problem as a game like Bubsy had, where you... You're expected to evade while things go very quickly through. It's just unreasonably fast. I died last time, but here I am with full health. <laughs> There's a trap on the ceiling. Oh man, he's he's crazy dangerous. Oh no. Next zone! What's up, Danger Zone 2?
What? What? I don't want the gas for my car. <laughs> this is wild. I guess you're the dummy this time. <laughs> Pretty funny. Little do you know, I'm a famed speedrunner of the immortal. My name is Slow Beef. Hello. <laughs> Where's my death counter? Yeah, you know what? We don't really want possessions, do we? Eh, I guess we do. I, hmm, Dunrick's ring. Hmm. Hmm. I'll take it. Now this guy, uh, fighting in this mess. There's, <laughs> there's some complications with combat in this game and I'm not sure I understand the intricacies of them right now. But uh, they do exist. You can win this combat reliably if you know how. I don't know how, so... Oh, this guy's a beast! Bars, there's things going on. <laughs> hey, friend. Yeah. Yeah, just keep throwing them at me. I love items. Can we have a uh, other? Yeah, let's drink this. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Uh, 
Oh, this game is very much not going to get explored by me, and it's, uh, it's definitely a, uh, you better read the manual first before even thinking about trying to play. Also, even then, you're screwed kind of game, but uh, Slow Beef did beat this, uh, if you're interested in somebody who actually knows what's going on in it, running through it's That ain't going to be me, I'm pretty sure. There's a lot of death and destruction in this game towards your character, not the enemy, mostly. I only have an hour today or so, so if you want if you want it to be the immortal the whole time, that's up to you. Oh, we fell down the pit. I don't, I'm not sure if that's good. That doesn't seem good. It's bad. Oh no. It's a pretty pixelated violent game too. Which is neat. It's got a lot of animations. We're starting over. That's uh, that's what's gonna be. Uh, unfortunately, playing through this game is gonna be a lot of uh, you're starting all the way over kind of thing. Stab, stab. I, I sure don't know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm losing this time. <laughs> that guy didn't help me at all. Oh well. Is this dude still injured? No. Oh, yes, he is. Okay, good. I was mixing up our health bars. I don't even know what to do next. I did watch uh, the LP of this, but uh, it's been so long. We got bait, we have spores, we do something with that, I just don't know what. We put the spores somewhere or something, maybe we actually go back in the first room with that item. Maybe if I put Dunrick's ring on, this guy will believe that I'm Dunrick. I think there are is an inventory limit, probably, is my suspect sufficient as to why we have a question about whether we take items or not. Okay. <laughs> Very strong. And those hurt real bad. I don't know what's going on with the tiles in here. It's just one of those games where... Uh, much like, like, I was playing, um... The hell was that game? With, uh, Patrick Stewart in it. Lands of Lore 1. And it just... 
Even playing through it, I still don't really understand most of what I had done by the time I've done it. It's so confusing. One of those hard RPGs. So I think I'm going to gong it now, just so we can move on, but Slow Beef Selfie is definitely where you want to go if you actually are interested in this.